I want to give a testimony about something that happened to me when I was a teenager. Around this time period, I was enrolled in youth sports, so I was in youth football. Okay. So, football practice would start around 1 p.m. and it would end around maybe 6 to 8 p.m. I forget. I don't know. Anyways, let me see. This one night, it was dark. I was riding back home, so I wanted to cross the street, so I crossed the street and I was almost to the other side. All of a sudden, this car was driving really, really fast toward me, and this car got about five feet in front of me, and my body went numb. Like I could not think, like I was so much in fear that I could not move. And you know how people say that their life flashed before their eyes? That is what happened to me. Like everything that I have done, everything that I have experienced, it came to me in an instant. I knew that I was dead, like I was going to die. And the crazy thing about it, this car came within five feet of hitting me, but at the last second, I don't know how. Let me say this too. I don't know if I said this. In the area that I was in, you can only go about 35 miles per hour. This car was going a lot faster than that. So this car came about five feet up hitting me or five feet from me. And somehow this car swerved at the last second. Like this car came inches of hitting me. I'm serious. Inches. Wow. And like this car was like, you know, really loud. This car was really going really, really fast. I believe that person was drunk. I really do believe that. And when the car left, my heart was beating so hard. Like if my heart could, I believe that my heart would have bust right through my chest easily. I'm serious. Like on the ride home, <laughs> I'm serious. Like it was like my breath, like somehow my breath emptied out. Like, I don't know how to say that. Like, <laughs> It was really, really scary, extremely scary. I could have died. And also, let me say this too. <clears throat> Even though I was young, 13 or 14, I knew of God, I knew right from wrong, but I still chose to do wrong. I really did. I believe around that time period, I would look at pornographic, videos and stuff like that things that I know that is wrong so if I would have died that day surely I would have been in hell surely let me say this we don't know the time or day when we are going to die you see that I could have died very young very young but God spared my life. Who knows? We don't know, or you don't know that you are going to have the same, or if God is going to have the same amount of grace on you that he had for me.
or has for me. I could have died at that age. You can die at that age. So no matter how young or old you are, repent of your sins now. Repent while you have the chance because anything can happen. Anything. You don't want to die in sin. I'm serious. Because if you die in sin, you can't go to heaven. So you are going to be in hell, which is not a good place. Because I could not say at that age that I did not know what was right. I did not know what I know now about God. Of course not. But I still knew some things about God. So I had no excuse at all. But by the grace of God, if that car would have hit me, surely I would have died. Surely. Because that car was going really, really fast. And I don't know what happened if angels came and pushed that car to the left to the point where <clears throat> it could avoid me. I don't know exactly what happened, but... I know that I was saved by God by far. So repent of your sins. All you have to say is, God, please forgive me of all my sins. When you say that, that's it. Then maintain your salvation. Follow the rules and regulations of the Bible. That's it. You don't want to die over foolish things. You really don't. Okay, God bless.